Hi, and welcome to another edition of 911 ERP TV. My name is Brian McAvoy, and I'm here today with Dave Mooney from Leader Group. And today, Dave is going to tell us all about the new thermal imaging camera that will be offered by 911 ERP. Dave, welcome. Thank you. This in my hand is the new Leader 3.3 thermal imaging camera. And for viewing purposes, we have it set up on the iPad in front of me. Uh, this does have a wireless connection to the iPad through its own wireless network. The 3.3 thermal imaging camera is a three button operation. And if you look at the top of the unit, you'll notice there's three buttons. The green button in the front for pressing and holding is just turning it off, turning it on again. However, by just doing a quick click on that first button, it creates a freeze frame which allows the user to bring the camera back into view and have a look at what's going on above their heads or around the corner so they don't have to get into danger. Awesome feature. And by just clicking that button again, we go back to live. The center button, uh, right now if you see on the screen, it shows down in the, in the bottom left corner, fire. That's the mode it's in now. But we have five colorization modes. As we do the click-throughs, the first one that comes up is the search mode, which adds the colorization. The top 7% of the heat within the vision of this camera is represented by red and orange. That's fantastic. So the top 2% uh, is in red, and then the next 5% in yellow colors, and then after that it goes into the black and white. The third option as we click through is what they call inverse or, or reverse mode, where you're looking at black on white rather than white on black. The fourth one brings up the cold mode. So the coldest part of the room, in this case, shows up in blue. And then the fifth option gives you the full colorization mode, the full spectrum. Now that, that cold option could be good in the case of a Freon leak, something like that. Exactly. Working inside an industrial area. With... And if you're looking at levels of a tank, if you've yes. got propane tanks and stuff, and you want to keep an eye on what level the tanks are at, Great. that cold Great. mode is, is good for that. Uh, the camera itself is a 2,000 degree range, so it goes from minus 40 to 2,000 degrees, and it, it'll change colorization modes as it progresses up into the next levels. The uh, same button in the center, that's the middle button, if you press and hold that, you'll notice coming up on the screen is a small uh, video camera, so now it is actually video recording everything it's looking at. It has an eight hour operation, so it'll just continue to record over itself and give you the last eight hours of video. Press and hold again, turns off the video option. Well, that could be great for a fast team, rapid intervention team, where um, they're going in to make a, uh, a rescue, potential grab, and uh, we want to be able to see exactly what operation and uh, how that occurred, um, what transpired, so that maybe we can critique it and work on, uh, you know, uh, best practices in the future for the future. And with the screen grab, which is also keeps a photo on, on file, or the video recording, all of it can be downloaded into a, a PC. So you can take everything that's stored on here and download it into a PC. Boy, talk about state of the art. Yeah. The front button at the front of the unit, a simple click on it gives you a two times zoom. Another click gives you a four times zoom and then back to normal. Press all, all terrific, terrific features in a camera. Right, and pressing and holding that front button turns on a laser pointer, which can be used inside fire operation to point out a hot spot to your colleague as you're working in there. That's great. That unit, the laser will shut itself off in a matter of 30 seconds or so. Now, no one else on the market has the laser feature, am I correct? No, there are some with laser features, but they don't combine with all the rest of the features. Right, that's what I mean. So, and we have full feature operation here. The other option is a removable pistol grip, as some departments prefer to have a pistol grip holder on the camera. Correct. And other departments prefer to have the hand straps. Yes. The wireless connection is here on the side, it creates an antenna. For uh, operational purposes, it's, it's good to have the incident command outside. You can connect up to three devices per camera. 
So you can have it on iPad, an iPhone, an Android phone, whatever, even on a PC. Up to three devices can be connected per camera. Awesome. So that way Incident Command can be watching or for training purposes it's ideal. When the trainee is using the camera inside, you could have up to three people watching what's going on from the outside. And that's an exclusive in the industry right now. Right now it is, yes. It gives you about a hundred foot range and uh, we're currently working on developing some repeaters that might be able to give it even more extended range in the future. Wow, that's impressive. Very impressive. So, that gives you all the features and functions of the camera. The whole unit weighs about two pounds with the batteries. Inside these compartments are the batteries. Those are uh, lithium iron phosphate batteries. Uh, the unit itself is a complete warranty of what we call a 5610 warranty. You've got a five year warranty on the camera, six years on the batteries, and 10 years on the core. Awesome. Well, the best part about it is that 911 ERP is going to be your premier distributor of this in the New York area. So, for more information and pricing on this item, you're going to visit 911ERP.com or give the office a call at 877. 572-9592 and you can speak to myself or Wayne and we can fill you in with all the information and if you're interested in the demo we can also come out and demonstrate the unit to you. Dave I'd like to thank you for coming today no and sharing your time with us and uh, your expertise in this camera and we look forward to working with you in the future. Good, thank you very much.